Right off the top at six, new Zika infections here prompt a strong warning from the CDC for pregnant women do not travel to Wynwood. Tonight, the latest on the growing Zika health alert. The new advisory comes as 10 new locally transmitted Zika cases were confirmed today, bringing the total now to 14. We've got live CBS 4 News team coverage for you, beginning with CBS 4's Joe Murray, who's live in the transmission area. Joan. Well, despite the popularity of Wynwood, Elliot, pregnant women are being urged not to come to this area. There is nothing more frightening than if you are expecting right now. And we just spoke to a local woman who is in that position. Yeah, I'm 28 weeks pregnant, and I'm, you know, I don't want to take any risks at all. Carrie Vidal used to live in Wynwood, ground zero for the Zika outbreak. She's expecting her second son in October. So I'm very concerned about my husband as well. Um, I've gotten his own bottle of repellent and we're taking all the necessary precautions uh, because as far as I understand, he can get it and we wouldn't even know. There are now 14 cases of Zika infection transmitted locally in South Florida, all originating in the Wynwood section, a one square mile area north of downtown. We have plenty of mosquitoes around here, but I'm scared because they say that the Zika is here in, uh, in Wynwood. Workers are going door to door, checking for mosquito activity and standing water. Are you finding a lot of water containers? Right now, no. No, there hasn't been a lot of rain, so you, you won't find a lot of that going on right now. Of the 14 local cases, two are women and 12 are men. Health officials are warning pregnant women to avoid the trendy arts district, popular with tourists. And England's public health agency has advised mothers-to-be to postpone non-essential travel to Florida. Zika has been linked to severe birth defects. Carrie Vidal says it's scary and she's taking all precautions. You know, it's definitely difficult going through a pregnancy in the heat of the summer. And now, you know, we really, there's mosquitoes everywhere. You can get a mosquito bite walking to your car or being in your car, you know, even in your, in your own house sometimes. They are everywhere, and despite massive spraying efforts, the CDC says we are losing the battle with mosquitoes. We are expecting an emergency response team be coming to this area of Miami soon. In Miami, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News. Joan, thank you.